Okay, we are live. I am back for another a beauty tip um, to share with you guys. And I'm super excited to be sharing with you um, our final um, night of the skin cycling routine. So we have been on the last few weeks here just kind of breaking down uh, the skin cycling process, which basically, um, let me go back to my, my shared screen here. Basically, the basic skincare cycling routine is just um, rotating your treatments on a more regular basis so that you can optimize your results um, out of your skincare system. So um, for those of you who don't know me yet, my name is Margaret. I'm going to um, jump in here and share a little bit more about night four, the restore and detox. Um, but I would love for you to uh, go ahead and, and uh, comment below if you um, haven't already kind of where you're tuning in from, just because I love to hear where you are tuning in from. And if this is your first time watching, Watching, um, any of my videos, just put a little one in the comments so I can um, warmly welcome you. So thank you so much for tuning in to our beauty tips here. And uh, we have gone over the basic skin cycling routine um, basically night one, just to do a little review, is focusing on exfoliation as your main treatment. And then night two is focusing on a retinol treatment. Night three is restore and nourish, which is mostly our hydration um, uh, focus on that night. And then the restore and detox is actually more of a um, kind of a resting and uh, relaxing, you know, um, night as well. And that's um, something as well that we like to, to put in our, our to insert our charcoal mask, um, which is a great detoxifier for your skin. So literally you're just going through those um, each night back to back. And if you need to kind of open up, um, have a few different days where you're not really doing um, a specific treatment, you can also do that too. So it's just kind of a basic outline um, of what you can do to kind of just bring into light a more um, consistent routine for yourself. And then making sure that you're hitting all of the main points of what your skin really needs on a weekly basis. So anyhow, so that's kind of what the skin cycling is. And each week here, I have been um, kind of going over um, which of the treatments um, that I really like to do and which products are good to use for them. Um, and also, uh, I wanted to make sure that you guys knew you can go back and watch those. If you haven't watched any of the other previous videos, then make sure to just pop in and you can go to those other videos and just check them out um, and break it down if you have any questions on specific nights or whatnot. But um, do remember to comment so that I know that you're here. And uh, I always do a fun um, kind of little uh, uh, freebie for uh, people that do comment and uh, engage in the um, in the videos here and everything. So if you want to type in hashtag um, MKVIP, then um, you will be entered to win a, um, a free gift from me. So I'm going to be doing that all month long. Um, and if you are one of my uh, personal customers, please let me know that you have tuned in because I have an extra special gift for you. So um, super excited. Let's go ahead and just kind of jump in and I'm going to um, uh, show you the slides again for each um, each night here. Let me kind of get, get that a little bit bigger. So we started out with, um, actually, let me go back and just share with you. Here we go. Remember that skin cycling is um, just basically a term. Okay. So it's just a term for um, figuring out kind of a schedule for you to cycle through your treatments on a weekly basis that works um, best for you and um, to help you get the maximum um, results from your skincare system. Okay. But first we have to have a skincare system. So if you don't already have a skincare system, you definitely want to um, consider uh, making sure that you've got a either, um, these are my two favorites, the TimeWise Repair Set or the th or the TimeWise 3D set. And if you're consistently using those, then you can start into a, um, you know, skin cycling routine, if you will, and just work with your beauty consultant to make sure you have a routine that works for you, fits your lifestyle, all that good stuff, trying to hit on all the main, um, you know, ingredients, active ingredients that your skin needs to, to continue to stay healthy. And if you do have, um, you know, a, a damage that you're trying to repair, you want to make sure that you're using the right products that are going to help your skin um, to repair from, um, from you know, sun damage and things like that. So um, my personal favorite, the one that I actually use, um, 
uh, is the TimeWise Repair Set. So that's mine. It's uh, what I consider the best of the best that I like to use. And so that's the um, set of my choice. So once you have that skincare set, then um, you are going to focus on your first night basically being your exfoliation night. So this is the slide that I use just to share with you. We have three different options. You have a, a radiance facial peel, um, a microdermabrasion, which is more of a physical exfoliator versus a chemical exfoliator, which is the, the radiance facial peel. Um, and we even have a, um, a naturally exfoliating powder as well that you can also use as kind of a light exfoliation. So what a lot of people do is they'll just pick one of those exfoliation treatments and you can just swap them. So the next time you do an exfoliation night, if you don't want to do the facial peel, then do the microdermabrasion or, um, you know, do the exfoliating powder. That's completely up to you on how you want to alternate them um, within that exfoliation night that you're doing. So, okay, so then um, night two is the focus on retinol. And I love a pure, pure retinol, retinol 0.5. Um, you can layer this with a calming milk. So if you have sensitivity to retinol, um, use a calming milk that's going to help you um, just to, to really avoid any irritation um, and allow your body to get acclimated to the retinol. Um, but retinol 0.5, five is awesome. So if you already know that you're just, you have tried and tried and tried retinol in the past and you know, you cannot possibly use it. Um, and hopefully that calming milk, cause that really makes a big difference. Then, um, we do have a, um, or I have another recommendation, actually the PHA AHA resurfacer. And so that is something that you can use that, um, will help, uh, try to get the, the retinol results, um, on your skin as well. So you could use that for night two. And then night three, of course, we've got our restore and nourish um, night. And so we're nourishing with hydration, um, picking either a biocellulose mask, which is the one I have on in my little picture there. Love, love, love this mask. Oh my gosh. If you have not used this, highly recommend it. Um, and then our moisture renewal gel mask. Awesome. Uh, that's also one you can use to uh, rotate as well. So you'll notice you're doing your basic skincare, you're cleansing, and then you're doing a treatment, following it up with your moisturizer and hide cream. And then we come to night four, which is our restore and detox. And this is our deep cleansing charcoal mask. Um, one of my favorite products, what sets this one apart um, that I really like is the fact that it has navy bean um, extract in it, which also helps to even out the skin tone. So not only are you detoxing your skin and getting everything out um, and cleansing those pores, but uh, you're bringing everything to the surface and, and getting it out, you are also helping to address um, the pigmentation in your skin as well. So that's what really sets this one apart. And I love it for that reason. And then you would just go back to your um, night. Uh, where is it? Night one, I think here, if I pull up my right slide. Lucky me. Will I do it? Yes. Night one. So you would just go back to night one and start again with your exfoliation and uh, your exfoliation of choice. It could be either your radiance facial peel, microderm, exfoliating powder, whatever that might be for you. So I hope that this has been helpful for you. Um, I plan to continue sharing these um, beauty tips. And I'm also on Sunday nights going to be sharing um, an actual application um, where I'm applying these products so you can see them firsthand actually how I go through my skin cycling uh, program. And so you can get an inside insider scoop on, on how to do that and how kind of quick, fast and easy it really can be. Because at first it can kind of seem like there's a lot going on, but they're really, this is actually a way to simplify your routine and make it more of a habit. And we know when we're more consistent and we have a habit that we are going to get better results. So Thanks again. Um, for those of you who have not subscribed to my YouTube channel, I want to recommend and suggest please head over. Um, I just passed 100 subscribers, which is a big deal. Um, so that's the, the first milestone, right? And so um, I would love to have you uh, come over to the YouTube channel, Margaret Lampkin um, on YouTube and click that subscribe button. So you will be notified every time I do a video. So have a great day. Thank you for joining in and I will catch you.